here if you can put a comment on my LinkedIn. That's it. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Mr. Jabber. We have a question from Dr. Ahmed. Uh, we, have, we can have one. Yeah. Thank you very much for your presentation. Thank you. I do agree with 99.98% of what you said, but I have 0.002% no that I would like to discuss with you. I, I don't agree about the notion of city as a product. City is service hub. Like Carrefour is a supermarket mm -hmm. of products. They are advertising products, but under the name of Carrefour, correct? Before this is you, exactly City. Correct, but before you go there, I just want to tell you another trend, okay? Yes. You mentioned about City as a service station. Service hub. Service hub. Economic, uh, what we say, evolution trend, or customer evolution trend goes from commodity to product, product to service, service to experience, experience to transformation. Now, you've got to decide what business you are in. You're still in the service business or in transformation? You're talking okay. about smart city, correct? No, I'm talking about a city. That's yeah, a yeah, city. I know, but yeah. then the, the, the concept. Disruptive. So, you know, basically, when you bring in a disruptive city, you're in the transformation business. Yes. You're transforming the society. Correct. Okay. So defining what business you are in is key. Then the strategy comes up. Sorry, carry on. Correct. But I cannot take it as a product. You can't take the city as a product? Yes. Yeah, it's a service. It's in that trend. So you can say, yeah, it's a service thing. Okay. It's more evolutive than a product. Okay. Correct. Yeah. But, you know, at the, fine. I mean... It's very much there. Okay. Yes. Uh, another observation is only when you talked about the example of driving. Mm -hmm. I think driving is a civic responsibility. Uh, this is not something that we can play with it. No, why not? Uh, Who's saying we're playing with it? It's a serious I, I business, tell you I something. understand. We are human and we are driving. In so? this case, the impact is in human. Correct. Correct. So? Yes. Yeah. We have people die or people survive. Yeah, but you want to decrease the people dying. Yeah, but not with gaming. No, you can. Because I can't. the reason I'm saying is, when you look at the, uh, one of the trends over there was uh, the death rates in over here is coming down, the accidents are coming down by 3% or 2% and you know, these are, um, what do you call, minor improvements. What we are looking for is breakthrough. We're looking at you know, double digit trend coming down. If you want double digit or more than 5% coming down, you have to innovate. You have to bring gamification or something Correct. else. Correct. But innovation is coming from the culture, that you have to establish a culture. Right. You have to do a big awareness to these young people to tell them, if you don't drive correct, you uh, will die. No. I, 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 it's a fact. It's not yeah, a no, wish. No, but, but if you bring gamification in there, right, immediately they go, wow, okay, I'm going to get some money and rewards. Okay, cool, man. I'm going to drive safe. Right? Right, there's, 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 there's another concept as well, which I haven't talked about. Is that you take into account, you got you know, informed decision making. But what we got over here is all that is knowable decision making. Okay? Gamification is one of them. Right? Why are we... Well, what is the speed limit here? Maximum 120 miles, kilometers, right? You can go, why am I got a car over here which is going 300 kilometers, okay? Why don't I tell the manufacturers over there, right, yeah. that make my cars 120 kilometers and then, you know, you'll have less accidents. So you're designing the whole society out by, right? The gamification, I will apply it from the first step when I'm doing a training for, to get the driving license. Gamification is a big concept. Yeah, yes. I, I'm talking about you know when to do it and how to do it. That's right. simulation. This is no, doing no, it for simulation, but not gamification. Now we're looking at gamification in, in many ways. One of which is how to connect it to the connected cars, and how do we use yeah. gamifications to even route people in cases of accidents and all kinds of things. Uh, yeah. So it's yeah. Even it's like the, you see when you decide on a concept, there'll always be yeah. ifs and buts which you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. Those ifs and buts have to be solved to get there. It's not going to be, I agree with you. Actually, but gamification what, will be very big in the future, I think, yeah. if anybody wants yeah, to, so as children, well, yeah, I agree. It's, um, animation and Let's focus on the concept. The concept is, uh, was, that, that Jabber is trying to say, if I may, yeah, yeah. Uh, is uh, now the, 
the traffic system is basically based on penalty. And, and how about looking at the other side? So just opening a perspective, gamification can be an example. It can be not a speci not specific my, solution. My, my main thing of that was to show is how do you change perspective and how you develop concept using this tool. Yeah. That was the key, yeah. right? We, at RTA, we're actually experimenting now with a, a loyalty scheme. So we have tried to turn yeah, exactly. penalty because that's the, you know that's the two ways you control a behavior reward and right yeah so we have a question from I mr ahmed civic responsibility it is It's not a question. Thank you very much for your informative uh, presentation. Uh, just a comment on, on the same uh, subject. Uh, if we go back to the definition of gamification, joyful engagement of your stakeholders, okay, then the picture becomes wider and the application of, of the concept itself okay, will be easier in any of these sure. stages, even in driving by showing or sharing some sort of top safety drivers in, in the city, okay, on weekly basis or, or monthly basis and rewarding them with some sort of yeah. uh, points or something that okay. they can redeem even in, in other. Uh, millennials will never get engaged in buying a concept or buying no, an idea unless it's in line with their day-to-day -day activities exactly. they are it doing. Links in, it links okay, in. Which is the leaderboards and others uh, in this, in, in whatever they are doing. Thank you very much yeah. for you.